What's up, guys? I'm videotaping a uh, fix for Steam. Pretty easy fix. In fact, uh, it's um, Killing Floor we are talking about, and we are talking about Steam. Uh, I've seen a lot of guys having issues with both um, perks, connection through Steam the game uh, interfering with each other and that you can have uh, Steam as a pop-up in the game. The fix for the Steam thing is easily just deleting the history and reinstalling the Steam, but it's pretty complicated reinstalling the game from the beginning because no steam from the beginning because you have to delete, delete all your games and everything so preventing that and preventing everything else you should just try to do this first of all you will exit steam like this and if you're not sure if you're disconnected probably from the game you should click on your keyboard control alt delete go to task manager and go processes and then scroll down till you find steam in this case i did not find steam but i will start steam again just to show you how it looks when steam is running you can see here there's my steam and if you click it mark it like that and click end process and then again end process you are not completely this steam is completely shut down now when you reinstall the steam without deleting the games you will go to the steam directory where steam is originally downloaded or installed to uh, you want two things you want steam maps steam maps is where your games in installed as you can see i have killing floor global agenda and a bunch of other games and they are portal here and everything is saved inside here you also want Steam, the program Steam, and if you're unsure if your Steam is which of these Steam marks it is, you can just go right click and click properties, then go here and check file type and see it's a exe file. This one you want. So now I drag both of these on the bottom. Now I can just go ahead and mark everything else up to the top. I have a bit difficulty here. If you have difficulties, you can just hold in in control and then multiply fix your maps. So if you want me to zoom out, maybe you have it in different formats when you see the Steam directory, you can see it like this, or this, or this, or like this. Well, hell no, how your computer looks like. But, anyways, it's normally like this. Now, I marked everything. I will go ahead and click delete and click yes. It said ya yeah in my language, but I believe you understand. Now everything is deleted inside Steam beside the program file and Steam Maps. Now you can go ahead and click Steam. Now you will see it's Steam is updating 0%. What is what it does is re-downloading Steam because it verifies every file in your Steam folder so it will work as it's supposed to do. Now, when I start Steam, 
the whole history will be de deleted and nothing will be saved so you will have to click in your safety password for example which I will find here while wow. it's updating okay it most likely will come here now we can just wait a second for it to finish to download uh, there all my files is, are back now I can log into my existing account click in my username and this so what my password is of course secret and I can go ahead and check remember my password since I'm uh, you know and then steam support whatever then go ahead and find my code copy paste next steam working bloody useless finish waiting when we now go to library you will see downloading has started it doesn't download it just verifies that the game is probably pro properly installed into your game so if I just go ahead and click play you can see it's ready to play and it got verified right away and can do the same here ready to play now both games are ready to play and I did not have to re-download them as I would if I reinstalled them. So thank you for watching whatever I did and hope this helps for you guys or myself. Goodbye.